everybody back to our hairstyles for straight hair series and you guys can do this with curly hair too although it might be a little bit hard um, this kind of looks like a half up half down do right well there's a twist we are putting jewelry in our hair check this out that's what this style looks like from the back and the best part is that that is a ring this is a ring that you wear on your finger and you guys are totally unlimited you guys can use whatever rings you have to get this tutorial um, to get this look to get the look in this tutorial. So this is kind of a half up, half down, and it's got this beautiful embellishment, and I have been seeing this a lot on runways. I've also been seeing it with feathers and other things, but this is just my version with a ring. So I show you guys my easiest way to get it on and how to kind of keep it secure. Um, I'll post a photo, and I hope you guys enjoy. So this is actually something that is super, super creative, and you can do it with any kind of ring. First thing I'm going to do is take my hair as normal, kind of place it wherever I want it to go. And then we're kind of gonna do a half up, half down look. You guys know probably how to do that. Do it the way you're accustomed to. If you guys don't know how, I personally like to take my hair right here by my ears, pull it back, and kind of taper off right about here. I like to take these sections and, you know, kind of flip them out, and then kind of put my hair up in a half up, half down motion by just sweeping these to the back and putting a ponytail in. And I'll show you from the back too. So here we go, we have half up, half down. Pull this back so it's sleek and add your ponytail. And you want the size of this ponytail to be um, about the size of your ring and I'm using an adjustable one just to make this easier. So here's what it is from the front and I'll show you from the back. And that's a pretty typical half up, half down ponytail. Next, you can take whatever you bring you choose. I'm using this one, it's kind of got a little pearly and a little bit of reds in it. And just kind of like you would administer a hairband or a hair barrette, we're going to put this ring into our ponytail. I'll show you how. For mine, I'm gonna loosen it up a little bit. And we're gonna put this ring right where we have the barrette by sliding it up the ponytail. The easiest way I find to do this is by twisting your pony. Take the end and completely, completely twist and try to compress it as much as you can. Like so. Once you've twisted and compressed to the end, it should be pretty easy to slip this ring through. You just want to work it up this shaft. Once you get to the top, it may be kind of messy, so you want to finger comb through. Next, you can tighten. And you want to take another barrette and use it just at the bottom like you did the top. Be very careful though because now you have a ring in your hair. This will help to hold the ring in place. If you guys need to, you can also take a bobby pin and push this up the back of the ponytail. If you guys divide the pony in half, you can take this and push it up halfway, making sure that it goes between both ring and both of the hair barrettes. Now we have it hidden from the back. And this is a great way to make sure it's adhered. So then you can style the rest of your hair as needed. You can put it to the front, put it to the back, you can curl it, do whatever you please. And I'll show you the finished results. Isn't that cute? And you can totally use whatever rings you guys like. It is easier to use the stretchy ones and maybe not one of the two fingered rings, um, but use whatever you guys have. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and I'll be doing more just like this styles for straight hair, styles for curly hair, styles for wavy hair, and how to put jewelry in your hair. So that's all, I'll talk to you guys really soon and talk to you all in the next video, which is kind of the exact same thing. <laughs> Love you, bye.